Good morning and welcome back to another video and today we're going to be going over the mailbox. Let us begin. Okay, so it's been some time before we've actually done the mailbox for pretty much the last couple of weeks. So let's go into this right now, shall we? I've been actually working on doing a lot with my TSM just to try and automate a load of different types of things. However, our first mailbox clean out, we have the lovely 134 mails to open for today and our initial 100 is 407,240 gold. Different types of items that I've actually sold that are of note are literally the transmuted items of Trillium Bars, Primordial Rubies, which is 21,591 of those, for, and we sold 1,256 of them. Same with Sun's Radiance, we sold 689 of that for 11,615 gold, along with Primordial Ruby once again, 127 of that, and Wild Jade, River's Heart, 15,000, and Wild Jade is 9,000. The other different types of things that we actually sold is we sold a Mecha Mogul Mark II for 83,000, along with Ashen Pigment, 2,364 of that for 6,739 gold. And the list is going to go on pretty heavily with Titanium Bars, 6,000 gold, River's Heart, 2,000 gold, the Glyph of Wrath of Wrath Guard is 2,756 of that. However, our big chunkers are titanium bars, 289 of them for 27,203 gold. And our big, big one is the Arcanite bars, 2,424 of them for 193,706 gold for our first clean out. That is pretty awesome. And we've got 407,240 gold in our bags. So let's just open our mails and let's pull in all of that gold right there. So a lovely 400K overall, that's pretty dang good. And our next one is a mailbox of 34 mails, uh, equaling in 106,215 gold. The notable items for that, this one is Arcanite Bars once again with a lovely 94,969 gold and we sold 1,188 of them and then mithril bar 1000 because that was just getting rid of some stock however i think you can see where a lot of my money is coming from and that is 106,215 gold let's pull that in right now equaling in a total bags collected of 2.5 million gold in our bags or 2,541,791 gold the thing of note that I've actually been focusing on when it comes towards just standard crafting and relisting on the auction house is making use of my transmutation procs. I actually sorted this out within my TSM so when I actually go into cooking it can actually produce me, it will actually calculate how much gold I can do with my transmutation. So if we go into restock, select my transmutes, press restock, it will tell me how much to craft based on how much of the region average daily sold is there, and then basically times the amount, because we want a little bit over the daily average sold, and then we want, and then it will tell me to craft that amount instead of a set amount that I perceive myself. So I have no control on how many I actually can produce, it will just do it for me. Along with that, it will actually produce it at whatever the profit is with the transmutation. So it won't work if you, you don't have the transmutation on your character. And it goes through the entire list in my TSM under my groups of transmutation. So if we go to transmutes, it will just select everything in there and it will see, can it actually proc and is it worth procking to make gold? Arcanite bars, you can make a lot of gold. However, it's not profitable at the moment because uh, I made good use of it when I didn't tell my patrons about that. Uh, the, uh, the other thing of note is when it comes towards all different types of profit, it is heavily, you have to put in a lot of gold to get uh, just a little amount back. When it comes towards the crafting cost of the materials, it's like 49,000 on this for 6,789 gold. But if you're doing that on the daily and you're selling that on the daily, 
it's not going to cause that much of a problem, especially when I'm just binge watching YouTube, doing other different types of work and all that jazz for just setting craft all and just listening to that and just making gold with each and every day. So six, 6,789 gold. And I basically am selling it every single day that amount that I list on the auction house, which is pretty damn good. Other different things that I'm actually working on, you'll see in the later videos for this particular week and the following week as well. So I'll have to keep you up to date with all of that. Other than that, I'm gonna get cracking on loads of other different types of low maintenance things when it comes towards just making gold in general, because I'm finding a lot of different other types of markets that are actually building out and are working very well, not just the transmutes in general, it's other different types of uh, crafted things that sell a high volume of them. So I've adapted my TSM profile, which you can also find on the Patreon, and I have just updated it as of today. Uh, you can see that for yourselves. Other than that, guys, have a lovely rest of the day, and I shall see you in the next video, which will be soon. Mm -hmm.